What's up YouTube? This is Victor on the Let Me Explain show and today I'm looking at the LG Thin Q washer dryer combo. And what I want to share is how you get it to wash and dry at the same time. And then in another video I'll show you how to just um ha have it dry your clothes without uh washing. I thought of doing this video because I came across a problem when I first got the washer dryer and realized that it's um it's not it's it's not um and realize that it's not intuitive it's something you have to work around so this is how it works um you power it on and once once it's powered on you select your cycle and once the uh, cycle is selected, you then go on to select your temperature and so on, um, just by selecting those buttons. And also you can select your drying time. So this is when I've put, uh, when I've selected my, my cycle and then I select dry, you can select normal time or, and if you keep pressing time, um it, it um, increases the time so that's basically how you get it to wash and dry at the same time if you i'm just going to power it off and show you what happens if you don't select the dry drying cycle so we've selected our cycle and if you just go ahead and press play or get it to run it won't dry if you haven't selected a drying option this is something you might want so that you can dry it at a time when you know you'll be at home and ready to take stuff out. But um, if you expect it to dry, you've got to hit the dry button and select the mode turbo, normal or timed. So that's basically how you get it to wash and dry. I'll run that through that one more time. So we'll start from the top. You sell, you power it on, then you select your load, bedding, whatever it is. And then you also have to hit the drive part before you you press start. So that's basically it. And um, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions about it, I'll be happy to answer it. Have a good one.